why do you, I mean, why is he getting booed? Because he plays too much golf? Because he doesn't speak good enough Spanish? What's he getting booed for? They just don't seem to... It's a very demanding Or is crowd, it because the fact that Zidane doesn't rate him and therefore they're taking Zidane's side? I think it's probably a little bit of everything, although it, he was, he's been... He's had an uneasy relationship with the fans even when, even when Zidane wasn't there. They've never really taken to him. I suspect there is a perception that he's not taken to Madrid. The golf thing, by all accounts, isn't entirely fair or true. That I, that I think Thibaut Courtois brought that up as a joke and it's been taken literally that they kind of associate him with being more of a golfer than a footballer. But there is definitely a problem there. I think the club would, would happen, not happily see him move on, but would allow him to go this summer if they can find a buyer. But when you've, you're, you're paid that much money, when you're 30, it's not easy to find clubs who can afford to take him, to be perfectly honest, especially with teams, I think someone like City, they're likely to look for younger and, to an extent, cheaper. reliable with his injuries as well? Would... That would be the question, yeah. And there's no resale value when you're 30? Not, not at 30. Jules, what are they saying on social media? Yeah, well, well, actually, Rory's pretty much said it all there, really, that he's getting booed by the fans, and the reaction on social media is very negative as well uh, from the fans. And listen to this from journalist Dermot Corrigan, who's actually there watching the game. He said the first Bale whistles oh, and boos came after again. less than three minutes after Bale miscontrolled the ball over the sideline. He said it's going to be a long afternoon for Gareth Bale. You know, we've, we've talked about whether he'll move on at the end of the season. Do you think it's almost a certainty? Think... Surely it's not going to be comfortable for him there at the moment with the fans up against him. But... Absolutely, but by all accounts, he wants to stay. He wants to. Yeah, this, well, if you look, if you look at, it from, look at it from his point of view, he's won four Champions League, scored in two finals. He is, he is the most successful British player of his generation, by by quite a long way. Because no one else has won that many Champions League. The problem I think they're going to have is finding someone who can take him, because on that money, with that with that status, and with that fee at that age, the list of suitors is pretty short, and that's the issue, that's the only thing that stops it being a certainty. I think. Yeah. Tim, what are you smiling at? I think they'd get people to take him, but they'd have to let him go for nothing, get him off the wage bill. Um, and I think there'd be plenty of teams who want to take him. I think the favourites would be Manchester United to take him in there. Um, well, you'd have to get rid of... Well, you'd have, would you get rid of Sanchez for Bale? Yes. Oh, one million percent. I'd, I'd, I'd book the Uber now and make sure we get Sanchez <laughs> in it. <laughs> I just think Gareth Bale is... Uber a, X, Gareth, Gareth, yeah. Had a flight. Gareth Bale is a superstar. He loves playing golf. That's why he's got three holes just made in, in his back garden in, uh, in Wales. But I he also you, loves I playing you, football. Yeah, no, I know oh, yeah. a boy like I do. He loves playing football and, and he loves garden. winning games. He's going to have to be a big character. To stand that, after two minutes, getting the bird, after two minutes of that big crowd with that big expectancy, he's going to have to be very brave because his game is all about getting on the ball, taking people on, taking risks. If he starts playing safe, he's not the Gareth Bale. He might as well get someone else on the pitch to do that. He's... Gareth Bale is the person who takes the game to the opposition, dribble past five people, sticks it in the top corner. He's done it for every club he's been at. He needs to leave there and go to a place where he's going to be appreciated. Absolutely.